Emrak and Liverpool's transfer dealings this past summer left a lot to be desired. They made a very good acquisition in the form of Mohamed Salah, who is already paying rich dividends and two players with potential, in the form of Andrew Robertson and Dominic Solanke were decent signings as well. However, the lack of a new signing in the central defensive area has been exposed severely in the past month or so, as the Reds failed to bring in top transfer target Virgil van Dijk. Another disappointing facet of their dealings in the recent past has been their inability to handle the American contract issue and resolve it. The German, who joined Liverpool for £10 million, entered the final year of his deal with the Merseyside outfit this summer and would be free to negotiate with clubs in regards to a summer move come January. Liverpool haven't been able to get to him to sign a new contract, despite having had prolonged negotiations that reportedly began in the summer of 2016. The 23-year-old German international has attracted strong interest from Italian champions Juventus, who have made no secret of their interest. Kahn's recent comments about the offer, where he claimed that it was an honour to have received an offer from Juve, have further cast his future in doubt. So, what should Liverpool do with a former Bayer Leverkusen man for me? They've got to get to him to sign a new deal at the earliest and keep him at the club. While there are a lot of fans who might not really agree, more so considering some of his dour displays in the recent run of results for the Merseyside club, there is no doubt about the potential and the talent of the German international. Having joined the club from Bayer Leverkusen back in 2014, Can, till date, has represented Liverpool on 138 occasions, scoring 10 goals and registering 9 assists. He enjoyed one of his best campaigns for the Reds last time around, scoring five goals and setting up two more in 32 Premier League outings. He has already scored and assisted two in nine games in all competitions this term, having been used all over the pitch by previous manager Brendan Rodgers. Ken hadn't really been able to showcase his best for the cop and it would NT be wrong to say that the 23-year-old has been unable to string in consistent performances for the club. Ken highlighted what he could do if he gets going, in the latter parts of last season, and started off the ongoing campaign brilliantly as well, before tailing off in the last few games and it should be noted that he is still 23 years old and has plenty of years left in him to grow and make full use of his innate abilities. Under the watchful eyes of Jurgen Klopp, Kahn has shown good signs of growth and development and without an iota of a doubt, there is plenty more to come from the former Bayern Munich man. He might have tailed off in recent weeks but the same can be said about almost all of his teammates and so criticising him alone would NT be fair. While some section of fans are of the opinion that the club will not need the 23-year-old once Naby Keita arrives from RB Leipzig in the next summer, his experience in the Premier League and versatility would offer a lot to Liverpool, and so the club should work towards tying him down to a new contract at the earliest, before more clubs come calling.